UC, I guess. Yeah, you see, before you see comes, maybe we could have a little break. And okay. before the break, we could actually briefly mention about so basically we sent a couple of links. Uh, yeah, my camera. Um, we have sent a couple of links for those who were not familiar with the Linux shell. I did some statistics with the with the, with what people answer when they register, and I would say that basically one third of you has rarely used Linux, which is fine. We we've all been there. So in the email that you received, there is at least one video, not too long video, like twenty minutes video, that would kind of help you to get started. And this is important because uh, what we're gonna do on day two tomorrow and on day three will heavily involve the Linux shell. You will need to connect to a remote computing system and, um, and basically run things through the using Linux shell. Yeah. Okay, I'll stop and, sharing then. Yeah. And then maybe Richard can, you're muted Richard, if you want to share the chat. Yeah, so schedule is here. Mm. And the second link that we sent is a little bit longer, it's from our same course that we did in the wind. And the idea is that it's computing workflows, the idea being that there's multiple ways of you know working with computers. So you might just be happy with your laptop and do everything you need to do with that, or you really need to scale. Yeah. So. Yeah. Mm, are we? Was this the summary of the videos now? Yeah. So we were doing. Yeah. Yeah. So. Well. Yeah. Maybe. I guess the main point here, maybe I can give my main point and we can see how they compare. So, yeah. So what we find as the biggest problem when adapting to the cluster for many people is being able to use the shell. So basically being able to do all your work automatically and scripted. So we have a video on this, which should get you started well enough to be able to follow what we do tomorrow. So please watch it unless you think you are good at shell scripting. And the workflows video is basically all the options that are not the computer cluster. And the reason we gave these as videos, we had them in our last course and they're still important, but it's sort of not worth doing them every time. So we have this modern technology that lets us do it once and record it. So, yeah. Uh, should we go to a break then? <laughs>